Hello everyone. Today is June 18, and then I'm just arrived home uh, from the town. Uh, I went around 11:30 this morning, and then arrived home around 1:30. So it took me around two hours uh, to buy some groceries uh, for me for this uh, new week. I decided to go to the bank this morning, and then to my surprise, when I arrived at the bank, there's a lot of people. The queue is very long And then after that, I went to another bank And then when I arrived at this bank The bank is run out of the money And then the officer said uh, Give them 30 minutes for them to refill uh, the money back And then I went, to, I went to another bank To check and then the same case happened The bank is run out of the money in the machine uh, I was so surprised you know, because today is Sunday and then uh, another thing also there's a lot of people uh, outside you know, the, the shopping mall not the shopping mall uh, the supermarket I went they are full packed with people uh, just wondering uh, why and then some people said maybe they are uh, shopping for uh, Hari Raya uh, the Raya celebration but then the Raya celebration is still uh, one week to go and maybe they prepare earlier uh, to avoid uh, hectic uh, during the last day of uh, uh, fasting uh, later on so the problem is uh, I don't have uh, much cash in my, in my wallet and then I have a very long list uh, to buy things so before I purchase uh, the items I went to the cashier and asking the cashier that uh, whether I can use my debit card or not and she said that uh, debit card is accepted but only thing that uh, you I must buy uh, 50 ringgits and above so when I look at my list I don't think so I have problem with that because there's a lot of things that I want to buy so I went uh, to get me a basket and then uh, just walking around so when I'm walking around I don't found Oh, I don't find the item that I want uh, they do have the item but then that's not the brand that I like you know so I'm having hard time uh, to select and to, to, to purchase uh, the item that they have in the aisles or they have in the, in the racks you know end up uh, I buy uh, something that is not in my list in order to help me to uh, get the 50 ringgit and above so it's quite frustrating though uh, because the supermarket I went is one of the biggest supermarket also where I'm working right now and then uh, they didn't have all the thing what I want you know so I'm quite frustrated and then after that I went to the cashier and then the cashier we have four aisles and then the four aisles also aisles sorry. and the four aisles also full with people no, I think I take around uh, 10 to 15 minutes uh, to wait in the queue you know and then uh, I also realized that you know uh, they already open an external or external uh, cashier to help uh, people or the consumer uh, run smoothly you know but then still it's not enough I think just now there's around eight cashier they add up okay to help us but still it's packed with people so as soon as after I bought the grocery in that supermarket I try my luck I went back to the bank and lucky enough the bank is uh, almost empty so I went into the bank and still inside it they have three uh, ATM machine and then three also full so uh, I waited at uh, another the number one ATM. So I have there are six people in front of me. I should be okay. So as soon as after I withdraw my money, I went back to my car and I went to another supermarket. And the supermarket, then I found the item what I want. So I go and buy. But now of course nice cash. I have the cash already. So also more, took me almost 30 minutes uh, to shop. And then a lot of people also in that place. You know, quite hectic. 
And then after I bought uh, the the item what I want, and I receive uh, text messages uh, from the uh, GTEx. They said that uh, the item that I purchased online uh, from Lazada Malaysia just arrived. So I went to the place uh, to pick up my uh, parcels. Then after that, after everything is settled, I decided to go home. And I arrived home around 1.30. So pretty much uh, that's what I do today. So after this, uh, I'll show you uh, the thing that I bought. <laughs> uh, only mostly is food. I know because I normally buy food uh, in weekly basis. So I will buy for one week and then finish. I will restock again the next week. The next week. This is to avoid that. This is to avoid uh, the expired, the expired uh, item. So this is the item that I bought uh, just now. I just uh, unwrap it. So I lay lay it out uh, on my uh, cabinet. So we will see uh, one by one. So first thing I bought just now is this one. Uh, this one is detergent. Uh, normally I didn't use this brand. But then uh, at the supermarket that I went, there is no brand that I like, so I just change it to this one. Hopefully the smell is okay. Alright, and then I have this dynamo uh, because I'm washing my clothes using a washing machine. Uh, so I use this one. Another one is of course the shell box mosquito spray. The problem in my house is uh, I have a lot of ants. I cannot leave my food unattended uh, just like that. Otherwise, the, an army of ants they came over to eat my food. And then next is the uh, shrimp fritter flour. Uh, this is very delicious uh, normally. So I want to be later on if I can do it. And then this is a shower cream, a soft touch. And then uh, this is. Uh, Colgate to wash my teeth and then a lemon sorry it's going on okay so this is a lemon the lemon also quite expensive almost 10 ringgit is 9 ringgit and 61 cent okay. and then next is Milo and I also buy the uh, kitchen towel uh, this is to help me in the kitchen especially when you have to clean up the, the stove and then after we uh, fried chicken wing okay. and then of course a kilo of sugar normally a kilo of sugar can last for five to seven months because i seldom get the sugar i only use it once and once or twice uh, in in a week and Eclipse okay. and then of course a sweetened creamer Corn Beef I love this brand this brand is the best brand I guess uh, the taste is nice and then when we fry the corn beef this one you don't need to add any other flour, uh, flavor for example you need to add the salt because it is nice itself but then it's very expensive it cost me around 10 ringgit plus this one for expensive but it's nice worth the pay and then this is cuttlefish uh, this is one of my favorite uh, junk food you know but then it's expensive as you can see this 8 ringgit and 49 cent that's very expensive yeah. and next is also one of my favorite food Apollo Apollo layer cake mm, this one well, uh, normally if I don't take my lunch or my dinner, I will eat this one together with the Milo, you know, during the hot Milo, so the taste is nice. And then next is the salted fish, eh, salted fish, uh, salted egg. I seldom buy the salted egg, but today I decided to buy it, and it cost me 360 cents, much money. And then uh, I love this yogurt drink, the zero fat. Yeah, zero fat, this is the orange flavor. So I'm gonna buy okay. And then next is uh, this one for wash the clothes also. 
it's downy, but then it's written in Thailand over there. So I be this one is produced in Thailand. And then uh, the most important part for single people like me is the eggs. The eggs is very important. So normally if I lazy to cook, so I just fry the eggs and cook some rice and I eat it. Next is a biscuit again. As I was saying just now, if I don't take my dinner or lunch, so I would do the junk food, which is not good, right? Not good, especially for us. And then next is the, uh, this one is a garbage bag. I use the, the L, the, the L size, the large one. Because it's, uh, it's easier to put all of this mess later on. And then next is the scale food and scale food. So this is all the thing that I bought from the supermarket. Actually, this thing come from two supermarkets, but then yeah, because I said this now, uh, the first supermarket I went, they don't have what I want, and then I go to the second supermarket. So apparently they have it. So that's all for today. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I'll see you again in my next uh, video. Goodbye.